Hey, what's up, guys? I'm back again doing another, another YouTube video. Uh, this one is going to be on my uh, hair products. Right now, my hair is not picked out. It's not picked out. But I'll show you how the length on it. About right there. Uh, about right there. It comes down to about... Let me see. Come down to right there. And, uh, yeah, it's not picked out. Haven't really picked it out in the last five days. Because I'm real hectic, you know. I just not moved all my stuff from the storage unit to one house. But, yeah, here's my products. Uh, here's Do Grow, the Mega Thick Lotion. Really good. I barely have some in here. I can open it and show you. A uh, tiny bit in there. Let me put this back on. Now, Do Grow is very good. It's, uh, it repairs damage and weaken hair and thicken the hair up. So, here's the conditioner. Alright. And, uh, here's the, you know what, like, here's the, Conditioner, yeah. Here's the Do Grow Mega Thick Leave In Conditioner. So you leave this one in your hair. This one, um, I probably probably rate four four out of five. Uh, sometimes if you put a tad bit too much, it turn white. But sometimes it still turn turn white. But it still makes your hair grow and repair your damage and weaken hair and split ends and whatnot. And this right here is the shampoo. I have about this much left in it with my thumb at. It. It's do grow is very good. If you don't use it, you should try it out. Now if you use main tail, that's good also. But I will advise you to get this or main tail because that's pretty good too. I used to use it. This right here is about five dollars, but some stores, beauty stores, you see this for about six, seven, and even eight dollars, and that's ridiculous. Just go to Walmart, and you'll find this for about five dollars, something like that. And I have dandruff, so I use this soft for eight. Uh, this helps out with my dandruff and whatnot. Um, hopefully all my dandruffs be gone. Next month or something like that. But it's very good. This shampoo leaves your hair kind of slick looking. Well, not slick, but silky looking. But, yeah. But after I wash my hair or whatnot, I like to use some type of gel. I don't recommend you use this one. Because this one is real stank and smelly. This, I'm going to open it up for you. This one is kind of green. It looked black, but it's green, but it's real stinking smelly. But I use this for the front of my fro. I put it on. I put it on my front right there. I make it stand up so it won't be all kind of, it won't be hanging off, hanging out. I mean, put it in, do like that, make it stand up. I also do the side part right there, put some gel and make it stand up right there. Cause you want, well, with me, I want my fro in the front standing up and make the block up look nice. And I have, I have to get a new peg because this not working out. I'm going to get the long one. But other than that, I'm going to make it a new video on the 20th. Yeah, on the 20th of my hair journey update number three. Or I might do a three point. 3.5 update, whatever. 2.5, I don't know. Yeah, 3.5. But comment, rate, subscribe. Uh, I'm doing a video every month, or every half a month. But yeah, peace. And uh, here's the other shampoo. This one doesn't really make your hair grow or repair damage and weaken hair, but this one right here is for a dollar. I picked this up at a store. And something like a dollar store, but this right here makes your hair very, very curly. 
I mean, it's for a man, shampoo and conditioner, and body wash, three in one. I just use it just, just sometimes to make my hair curly. I'm going to do a video um, on this right, this shampoo right here, or body wash, whatever you want to call it, three in one. And to show y'all that how much this shampoo make my hair curl, it's pretty damn nice. But it smells good. It's practically full. Only use it one time. But these products right there. And uh, yeah, stay tuned. And uh, peace. Yeah, my hair looking all fucked up. Gray looking. I haven't washed it. Well, picked it out. But uh, peace, man.